New Ken player, he's a transplant, I think, from California. Mm -hmm. Came up here recently, did pretty well at Northwest Majors, and um, has been making pretty consistent waves at our, in uh, our monthlies. Yeah, definitely. Devin's been working hard. Uh, I've seen him at the battle lounges. Uh, he was getting some sets against Knuckle Dew the other day when Knuckle Dew was in town. Oh, yeah. So uh, he's definitely working hard at uh, you know his technique and just improving and learning everything that he can. So cool to see him doing well, and also cool to see somebody, like you said, that's uh, a little bit unusual for uh, our community and uh, yeah, reaching some, the, some new blood injecting some new yeah. play style and stuff like that will be good. We don't really have a Ken player since uh, Veer Saga. Shout out to Veer Saga. Decided that you know went home to be a family man, which is always good. Yeah, yeah, that happens. Um, so yeah, uh, lo looks like we're gonna get right into it. Uh, we got uh, Octo Taco on the two player side playing and Bison oh, and Devin playing Ken. Fight. Yeah, Bison also you know pretty well represented in Portland through Disco Vigilante, but. Uh, just hearing players complaining about Bison, so he's a, he's a weakness for a lot of players in town. Yeah, you know, we have quite a few Bison players, but um, Bison is very strong this year. You know, a lot of people play some top five, and we'll see if Octo Taco can show us why. Starting off pretty well. He's already got Devin pushed into the corner. Yep, Devin's, you know, good defense, though. Nice anti-air right there. Devin was getting ribbed the other day for his uh, lack of dragon punches. Well, that was not a dragon punch, but uh, yeah. it still works. <laughs> So, out, oh, pressure. the punishable didn't go for anything major though. Octo Taco is really trying to uh, maintain pressure with scissor kicks, so he's doing a lot of heavy scissors, which there's gaps. You know, D uh, Ken can DP those sometimes. Um, so, oh, wake up Tatsu from Devin there to get uh, Octo Taco off of him. B trigger combo misses it. Okay. Oh, nice. Put him in a little bit of power there. Stun bar pretty high up too. Yep. Good mix up. Nice. Oh, there we go. Crush counter sweep for the stun, and this should be it. Simple jump in takes it. So the first round goes to Devin. You know, I didn't think he he was actually put in the corner pretty much, as uh -huh. you said, really yeah. early on. But he was able to turn around with a good V trigger. And um, let's see if Octo Taco can fight back. Yeah, Devin definitely kept his head down and just focused. And uh, then at the end, was able to just kind of string together enough damage to take that first round. Right. Yeah. Just you got to block it out sometimes. Yeah. Good cross up. Yeah. Nice confirm. Hard kick Tatsu knockdown mix up. Oh, nice. oh gets the overhead. EX, yep, EXDP, and he's got him stunned nice. again. Okay, now we got a big combo here. No, he's gonna use meter. Oh, he goes for the full damage. Now, see, this is a dangerous situation, though. Okay. Octo Taco is gonna activate. There we go. And now we've got to see what uh, Devin's defense is like against this Bison. Yeah, great sweep. Following up after uh, Bison with that tech throw. Checking the dashes really well. EX scissor kick to start pressure. Okay, okay nice. Reads the dash in and just hits Jeb. That was a very good first set for Devin, you know, especially starting off having things kind of go tough at first, and then just coming back super strong, and then that round was right. just strong the whole time. So Yeah, you know, I mean, I think, I think the big thing with Devin was is he wasn't letting Bison get any of his shenanigans started with yeah. V-Trigger. That really saved him there, because I think a lot of times Bison could turn around that situation with a few good V-Trigger reads. Yeah, those uh, dash teleports are super strong. Yeah, you get one knockdown, and then the mix-up between dash throw and dash uh, button becomes very strong. Mm -hmm. Round one. Okay, starting with our second set here. He's playing some neutral. You know, it looks like Octo Taco's a little bit more reserved. We're not seeing him go in with scissor kicks quite so hard. He's trying to hold his space a little more. Finds a hit, gets a little knockdown pressure. Stand hard punch into hard kick scissors, not plus. Oh, gets the overhead counter hit, still gets the combo off of it. Goes for it again, punish. Nice, nice punish. Yeah, definitely. He's ready for it that second time. Oh, oh for it, but now. Yeah. Opening Wanted the door. to chase down the slide, didn't do it. Yeah. Okay. Well, health bar is pretty even. Nice crusher. No follow up, though. Yeah. Okay, maintaining pressure with scissor kicks. Got him in a good first. Devin V triggers to get back out. Nice EX scissors to keep Devin in the corner. Yeah. Good throw. Now we've got the mix up here. Doesn't go for the meaty throw, goes for meaty jab. Stand hard punch, block. Oh. oh. Good read on the neutral jump, but he just snuck under him. Wake yeah. up Tatsu, no punish. Devin can still do this. He's got a full stick of butter. Oh, uh, he's plus there. Blocks, punish. Doesn't get the full punish. Oh, that's fancy. Okay, minus two, activates to keep himself safe. Devin's in a tough spot here. Can't get chipped out, but he's got a really, any hit will do it. Yeah. Oh, oh no, confirm there. Yeah. 
does not get the hit confirm there. You know, uh, that hit confirm is definitely doable. It's not the toughest thing in the world. If you play a little third strike, probably used to hit confirms a lot harder than that. Yeah, instead he just takes himself a little bit deeper of a hole because he has uh, unloaded his butter. As it were. No more. Finds a knockdown, goes for neutral jump, mix up, gets a throw, dash in. Stand light punch into EX Fireball, check it, plus frames. Keep that sun bar up. Yep, keep an Octo Taco really cornered. Oh, oh. Octo Taco whiffs throw, no punish. Yeah. Oh, whiffing throw again, just throws whiffing all over the place. But his stun bar still up. Devin could still do this. Finds a hit. Oh, nice, nice. throw. And, oh, ooh, shenanigans. Yeah, that was a lot of stuff going on. Yeah. Very real cross up. Okay, tries to, didn't really need to do that. He wasn't at enough. There you go. Okay, oh. that's interesting. And the Tatsu beats the EX head stomp, or the maybe that was a regular head stomp, but um, yeah. yeah, Tatsu beats head stomp. That was interesting. Yeah, crowd was a fan of that one. Uh, at least those shenanigans were a little bit more clear cut than uh, Bison just sliding underneath. One that I had really pet to the line. Devin's got to really be reading the fact that Octo is pecking after every jump in. I want to see some jump in into Shimmy instead of just neutral jumps. The neutral jumps aren't cutting it for him. Finds a CC, gets some pressure. No good meaty, gets thrown on wake up. Octopaco working his plus frames. Devin finds a jump in, goes for a stand medium kick, stand medium kick, target combo. Okay, nice. Finds another hit. Now he's got him in the corner, blocks the overhead. That's one too many overheads, Devin. Yeah. Okay. Minus frames there. Devin takes advantage, finds a good combo. This should do it. Oh, he didn't spend the meter. Why didn't he spend the meter? Minus there. And finds the hit. And that's it. Devin takes it. Yeah, and the uh, player's a little bit of confusion over his, uh, the it format, is, but... It is still two out of three.